That is the key to this business. Everybody can't come to a meeting every night, right? right? But people want to make money from home, right? So we're going to talk about how do you build a successful business from home. Okay? You got a pen pad? You ready? You need to have a list of 25 people that like you and you like them. Okay? Once you get that list, you have to get that to your upline. So, for example, the YPs. Everybody say what's up to the young pioneers. These guys, man, y'all fired me up. These are the YPs. Can we get it? Young pioneers? So, for example, imagine we're all out here going door to door and we're trying to find new people. How many people do you have in your phone? A lot. How many people do you have in your phone? How many people do you have in your phone? How many people do you have in your phone? Ten? <laughs> 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 you just got a phone? Oh, okay. How many people you got in your phone? Forty. Okay, great. So let's say, for example, because are you having problems with with you think getting people? Is, are people having problems with that? Getting people? No. Well, I know y'all not. But for example, the key is to engage ASAP. Everybody say engage. 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 When I got into business, I didn't wait a week, I didn't wait an hour, I didn't wait a month. I immediately, immediately set up my coffee break and immediately had my people call. How many people are doing that? Honestly, don't lie. Okay? Okay, great. Now, once you engage, meaning once now that you have the, the list, you have a set coffee break. What's the next step? Can anybody tell me? Set a date. I can hear you. Set a date. Okay, you have you have your set you have your set date and you have your list. You have to bug, blow up, constantly call your upline to do what? Help I'm sorry? Questions. Help you call the list. Okay, just because you purchased a business does not make you a business owner. Did you catch that? Mm -hmm. So for the first two years, you're going to be an employee to this business. So you have to do work. But if you want to grow a business with 10, 15, 20, 30,000 people, guess what you have to do? You have to duplicate yourself. One thing about me uh, and Lorianne, some of the other leaders, Shalom, you'll get sick if you don't duplicate yourself. If you're up here all the time doing meetings, this, 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 for everybody, your business will not grow, okay? So this is very, very important that you do this. Once you get, so for tonight, we got, how many, how many new people you signed up? You signed up two. Can we give them a round of applause? Two new, two new, two new right? So tonight, we need to get their list and set up the coffee break. coffee jam okay now if me if someone tells me that they, they, they they're not gonna do a coffee break I will not sign them up you know why because it's a waste of my time and it's a waste of their time so now we set your coffee break up let's say it's you want to always make sure that you set a coffee break up seven days from enrollment period we got seven days to get you a check how did that feel to get your check today how many people here got checks so far how does it feel when you get a check? So imagine how, how the next person would feel that you enrolled if you helped them get a check. 
So once they get a check, what are they gonna do? Go crazy. Yeah. They gonna they gonna duplicate. And they gonna duplicate, right? <laughs> so once you set the coffee break, we come out and we close the people. Okay? Everybody say close the people. Close, close the, the people. people. This is very important. A lot of people forget this step, believe it or not. A lot of people have a coffee break and then leave. I don't get that. You invite all these people over, you don't, you don't, this is when you sell the coffee or you close them into the business. Okay? But guess what? If you don't ask, they're not going to do it. So it's very important that you ask which package. Now, this is very important. At the close, you have to basically tell them. You got to remember that people have worked their whole entire life, right? So what, what, what that means is they're not used to making a decision. They're used to someone telling them what to do. So you have to say literally, so which package are you starting with tonight? The X1, X2, or X3? X3. Give them a round of applause, right? <laughs> but guess what? And I know why your business is not growing. You're not doing this step right here. I guarantee it. If, if you sign up anybody brand new, you need to get the list immediately. Let's go to work. You have a list? Thank you. Down, have a list. Now, you guys have put in probably what, 60 something people maybe? 50, 60 people? In less than three weeks? If, now, now, let's do the numbers. So you just put in 60 people, right? Easily. Times, let's say they all have 20 people in their phones. How many contacts is that? Well, 60 times 10? 1,200. That's 1,200 leads. Did you catch that? Why do you have to go to a mall, stand on a corner, if you can get 1,200 leads? Okay, now, we have a script. Is this a script too? Do you have a script? I don't think so. No? Okay, so here's a copy of the list. Do you, do you have any more of uh, the, uh, the list? Who needs the list? Anybody else need a copy of the list? Now, I'm gonna kind of read to you what we put on our list. If you're taking notes, we put the, if you, you know, want to create your own. The name, of course your name, your sp whoever sponsored you. When your enrollment date and what package you came in at. Also, we, we want to know your six month financial goal. That's very, very important. Not one month, not two months, not three months. What is your goal in six months if you work this business? Because you got to at least give us six months of a commitment to see a result. Is that fair? Yeah. It's kind of like working out. You can't go to the gym. Well, I can't, but that's what. <laughs> yeah. so, you can't go to the gym once and expect massive results. you got to continuously go to the gym to, to achieve the results. Now, once you get the list filled out, it's very important that you put the relationship. So, for example, if it's my brother, put brother, cousin, uncle, nephew, whatever, because when we call that list for you, we're going to call and be like, hey, how you doing? Uh, my name is James Wiggins. I'm calling on behalf of Jaime. I actually am his business partner, and we're having his grand opening event. Are you his cousin, Michael? Yes, I am. Great, because Jaime is so excited about his brand new business, and you being his cousin, he knows that you're going to show up and support him. Now, what is that? what is he going to do? He's going to show up. Why? Because I make him feel guilty. Right? So it's very important that you put the relationship down. Now, once we do that, what do we do? Once they come in, we sign them up, what do we do with them? Do the same thing. Duplicate, duplicate, duplicate. Now, imagine tonight we have about, that I know of, we have six meetings going on. Okay? Tonight, right? So let's say we got six meetings, and let's say I need six meetings, six events, and let's say we enroll 40 people tonight. And let's say they all purchase $200 in product, right? 40 times 200 is what, 8,000? Right? 8,000 
times 20 percent is what? $1,600. The way you build your business is by having coffee breaks and events going as much as possible. So we want to focus. So what we're going to do today after this is I want to sit with you guys. We want to get your list going, and we're going to set up coffee breaks. Because I didn't know I was going to come up here and speak, but Mr. Miramoto made me come up here and speak. So. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm big enough to do that. Yes, he is. <laughs> Does anybody have any questions? Good? Mm -hmm. All right, so let's get these lists filled out, especially the bar fees. Let's set up your coffee breaks, and let's, let's duplicate this ticket to the next one. I have two cents left. I, I, okay. I don't have any more. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, last week, Lorraine, can you come over here?